Today is officially the happiest day of my life because the LEGO Technic Lieber LR13000 Crawler Crane has finally been officially revealed. I will tell you everything you need to know about this set. It comes with 2,283 pieces, which doesn't seem like much, but it looks absolutely massive. In fact, it'll be a full meter tall, which is insane. It comes with two Control Plus hubs, as well as six motors. Unfortunately, since the XL motor has been discontinued, we will not be getting those in this set. The first hub is used for the massive chassis. The tracks are extremely long, and it'll be a ton of fun testing it in some off-road terrain. There will be three motors in the chassis, one for the left track, one for the right track, and the third motor is for the rotation of the superstructure. Speaking of the superstructure, it'll use another Control Plus hub with three more motors. There will be boom elevation, jib height adjustment, as well as the raising and lowering of the massive hook. We get a ton of some brand new specialized frames for the boom pieces and it looks absolutely incredible. If you would like to get more news of upcoming LEGO Technic sets, early reviews and so much more, then make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications. No pressure though. Unfortunately, each motor is responsible for its own function, meaning that we will not be getting gearboxes or any other advanced mechanisms like what we saw in the CAD D11 bulldozer. I think that this crawler was the perfect opportunity to finally make a proper successor to the 8043 motorized excavator, having all four motors in the superstructure while using a ton of gears and incredibly complex mechanisms to power everything. The motorized excavator from 2010 had two separate independent motions passed through the center of a single turn table, which was just insane. I really wish that LEGO would make something similar again. Now, let's talk about that massive $700 price tag. You heard that right, this set will be that expensive. The Lieber Excavator that we got four years ago came with 1,225 more pieces and an extra motor while retailing for $250 less. I think that this set is exactly like the UCS Imperial Star Destroyer of 2019. Both are priced at $700 while having very few pieces for their price. However, the reason why they're so expensive is because both of these sets are just massive and we have to consider the size rather than the piece count. I can't wait to see how the new crawler crane size compares to that of the CAD D11 bulldozer as well as the 42100 excavator. What are your thoughts about that massive $700 price tag? Please let me know in the comments. This is your Unbreak Me here and I'll see you in the next one.